Carr plays on quickly again. Onto the left. Beautiful looking kick. Diving mark taken by Treadray. Picture of concentration. Like at the moment it left the boot. Port have their first. Josh Carr, normally good hands. Good give to Sean Burgoyne. Beautiful mover to Wilson. Back to Burgoyne. There's the pass. Looking for Lade. Didn't find him. Picked up by Cassisi. Kicked four against the Saints last week. And has his first today. Schofield <laughs> gathers on the outer wing. Keeps it low. Good kick. Finds Carr. Chips it up. Charging out Treadray. This for a 19-point lead. He should kick it. And he does. Short pass, Treadway. Plays on. Onto that trusty left. He's non-preferred. Gets plenty of purchase on that. Later to apply the spoil. Pickett came through quickly. Taken by Thurston's. Has a quick look over to Cassisi, the goal kicker. He kicked another one and he's loving it. Kicks it beautifully up to the wing. Running onto it will be Wakeland. Has plenty of support. Cochrane going into open space. Long penetrating kick. Treadray won out. You'd back him, wouldn't you? You'd back him. And he does. Clinical. And the move has been made. Jared Teagers uh, now moved up the field and Thornton has gone on to Treadray. So we'll keep an eye on that one. Another clearance for Port Adelaide. The mark taken by Kane Corns. Treadray may get another opportunity now and he does. Chance to stretch the margin out to 35 points. Oh, he's on target today. Treadway has kicked four in the first term. Little chip pass over the top from Peter Burgoyne to Kane Corns. Treadway again. Geez, hard to stop. Very fit, very strong. Covers a lot of ground. Look at this. Pumps it inside. And just too much height, Brendan. Too low. big. Quick handball. Put Cassisi under pressure, but he's got his third. Houlihan, close to the boundary line. Now he needs to change tack and to risky kick, but it was a good one. Thornton spilled it. Burgoyne picked it up, and they get their ninth. Well, this would take his best kick. There's the reverse angle. It's right on 50. He's pushed that one out to the right. Won't get the distance. Teague front position. Picked up by Houlihan. Wrapped up by Lade. Now taken by Stewie. Joe, and he snapped it. They've kicked 10. Walker with good skills took on Laid. It's a talent. He's run 20 metres, but got away with it. Got a little bit of toe. Puts it up the midfield. Burgoyne, too easy. Now a bullet like pass. Looking for yes, Brogan. Yeah. Treadray it was. Didn't take it. Snapshot there from Peter Burgoyne. He's kicked his second. Goes to ground. Not sure of where to go. Still got time, however. And finding space. Treadray plays on. Wilson. Hardwick can kick a goal or give it to Stewie Jew. Three second this quarter, the crowd loves it. Pretty tough to get a kick out there. <laughs> Especially under, if you're in the back half. Down to Marnie again. Centered that beautifully. Oh, huge leap, Ebert! And that's my point, there's no crumbs. <laughs> it's either Warren Fredro taking a grab or Brett Ebert coming over the top. And as I said, a huge leap. He landed right on his head and neck too. He is a talent. Oh, man. That a nice old twist. You can be sure of one thing. He's not going off just yet. Houlihan changes tack. Good kick. Oh, dropped. Spilt. Ebert in there. Good pressure. Seven seconds remaining. Picked up by Hardwick. Short pass. Three seconds. Stewie Joe's kicked his third. He's rejuvenated. Short pass. Corey McGrath, who turned it over badly before in defence. Oh, over to Nick Stevens. Oh. That's possession number 11 for Stevens. And has he kicked it? No, he hasn't. Oh, this is cruel. This is the crowd. Uh, great service to the club, 127 games. But uh, as Mark Williams said throughout the week, you just don't leave Port Adelaide. Hotel California. So does Byron Pickett. Impressive indeed. Great goal, Byron. <laughs> he's not going to chip it to himself now. He does that. I'll run down and tackle it. He's thinking about it. 
Too much pride. He's thinking about Too it. Too much pride. Right. Wilson won't let him do it. Do it, Nick. Do it, Nick. <laughs> yes! Does he get rid of it? Yes! Jared wins the money. It's a turnover, though. Stuart Jew in the pocket. Centering ball for Pickett. Well, what oh, was he? Oh, boy. What was Nick Stevens thinking then, honestly? He what? was a team man. <laughs> what could he possibly gain from doing that? He was thinking that? team. Oh, you've never seen folks, Jared Healy, this excited <laughs> in an 82-point game. <laughs> Josh Carr, 25 possessions. Schofield, likewise. Marnie's picked up 20. As the siren sounds, and a most comprehensive victory to the Port Adelaide Football Club. 18-15, 123. Carlton, 5-10-40. And as we see Nick Stevens, and I'm sure the players will shake his hand. And a hug to boot. Obviously, immensely disappointed Nick Stevens, but all the talk about the ill feeling towards him, Jared, didn't really see it this afternoon. No, I think it was all words. I think uh, you could see Mark Williams' face uh, with, his, with the, his interview with Tiffany at the start. That he had bigger issues on his mind than uh, going in trying to take a cheap shot at a player he probably uh, still admires greatly. Like Stuart Dew, the late call-up for Gavin Wanganeen. Surprising circumstances. He kicked four goals, so on the surface, a good result. Your impressions of Stuart's game? Oh, yeah, it was a uh, pretty opportunist. Uh, you know, uh, it's, it's what Stewie does best, and I was pleased that he could uh, get amongst the goals. You know, he trained really hard yesterday. We, we had no idea that he was going to be playing today, but I knew he was here, and I, I certainly knew that he hadn't played, so uh, it was a good choice. Crowd nudged underneath it by Pick.